Oh, just, just go away. You can go away. Sophie's thrown her dinner on the floor. Oh! And we are back for another one. So we've just found that um, the twins absolutely hate uh, their sister, which is not brilliant. What's he crying for? He's... Yeah, an unwanted new sibling. That's lovely. So uh, this is going really well already. Um, everything's disgusting. The kids need a wash. I've relented and just had to... Um, stick Layla in the bathtub just purely because she is not doing anything otherwise <laughs> oh oh Sophie really doesn't like Eve at all does she okay so we need to um everything's very very critical on Layla's um bars and everything at the moment so we need to um get her to try and calm the children down She also needs to give uh, Zach a bath at some point, but she needs to take a nap or sleep first. Oh, maybe not. See, this is what happens every time uh, she tries to take a nap. One of the kids needs her, so let's see if we can get her to sort Eve out a minute and then she can hopefully take a nap. Yeah, so Zach absolutely stinks. He's got all the uh, all the stink lines around him. Uh, she's got. She really needs to eat something. I think she's going to pass out soon, and her fun is just non-existent. So we're doing well. Oh, good grief! Now we know not to have a new baby when we've already got twins. This is not working out very well. You saw in the last one, everything's just disgustingly filthy. Um, everything's the same now as well. Barco's turned up, so the um, the twins' dad has uh, has turned up. I don't know if he'll be any help or anything, but we'll soon see. Let's see if we can... See, she's feeling very playful, so maybe maybe she could play with, with one of the babies. Maybe she could play with Zach a minute. Eee, there we go. That's really sweet. Well, Barco likes that. Barco likes that he's, she's playing with him. He's not actually engaging with the kids at all, though, which is hard. But there you go. Oh, good grief. Right, okay, let's see if we can... Oh, what's going on here? Oh! Oh, dear. Well, that, that didn't go down very well, did it? Oh, dear. So, apparently, Sophie doesn't like her dad. That's helpful. Oh. Okay, so she needs to, she needs to actually feed the twins. So, you've got two high chairs to do that with. Just because it's easier. She still needs to give Zach a bath because he stinks. Yeah, I know you want some telly, love, but tough. you got three kids. You've got two toddlers and a baby to look after. So, right, you need to put... Hang on a minute. Okay, so she's she's going to pass out from exhaustion, but she's holding... She's holding... So Where are you going? Where are you... Okay, this is going to be interesting. She's quite clearly going to pass out from exhaustion. She's holding Sophie and she's walking round to the back of the house. What's going on? Oh, oh, don't drop her. Oh! Okay. That's very, very strange. <laughs> um, okay. No wonder Sophie's not very happy in that position. Blimey. That's not going to do her back any good, is it? <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, so feed Sophie as well. We've had a random child turn up. Um, one of the neighbour kids. So, yeah, you can come in, I dare say. It's a little bit creepy, but okay. Okay. 
Oh, and the kids are crying. Maybe, maybe she'll play with them while she sorts one of them out. Oh my goodness, the, the child we've let in has just immediately come in and is making a mess all over the kitchen floor. What the chaff? Oh, it's almost Eve's birthday. That will make things a lot easier because she can then take them all out. Okay, so the child is upstairs and has made a mess all over her bedroom floor now as well. With, like, flour and ketchup and everything. And I can't send her home. There's no send home. Aww. Oh, dear. She's going to land face down in the mess. Right, go and sort Eve out a minute. Let's see if we can get her to sort her out. And, no, you need to get out of the way, child. Right, no, no, change the dirty diaper. No, you can't get there. Right, child, you need to move. Oh, how can I get... There's no, like, send home button on her now. Oh, I can't... Right, I tell you what, let's, um... You still can't get there. Right, child, move. Oh, who is this child, anyway? What the... Okay. Right. No. Lovely. It's nice that you're having a conversation. Tell her off for making a mess. Right. Don't. No. Don't go downstairs. You need to change your child. Oh, it's all going horribly wrong. Come on. She's this knackered having three kids. How's she like going to be like with a hundred? Right. The 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 demon child is making... We've only just cleaned up after the first lot. And the demon child is making a mess all over the floor again. Oh, just, just go away. You can go away. Sophie's thrown her dinner on the floor. Oh! Right. Nasty child. Go away. Get out of my house. There's another child waiting to be let in. I'm not let I'm not making that mistake again. Go go off with your friend. I don't want another random child that I can't get rid of. Bad enough she can't look after her own kids, let alone anything else. Or at least she's actually mopping up now. So that's helpful. Right, you need to let her out. Why are you not letting her out? Come on. Okay, let's invite Bob Pancakes round. Because she's never going to meet the next baby daddy at this rate if she doesn't start socialising with some other people. So let's see if we can get some people round. Because she can't leave the house because you can't take the baby with you. So therefore she can't leave. Oh, now Sophie's... See, look, she's taught her... Oh. At, least, at least she's out of the toilet this time. Oh, we are not doing well. Honestly, these twins are not going to grow up well. Right. Let's, ah, send home! Send home! I can send the demon child home! Yes! Excellent. Oh, no. No, don't pass out before you send her home. No, don't! Don't! You have to send the demon child home. Okay. As you can see, Bob Pancakes turned up. So did Bjorn. And the demon child is still here. Ugh. Okay. Let's feed Eve. I don't know how to get rid of this random child. She comes in, makes a mess, and refuses to go home. It's been days. She won't leave. 
Should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out. Well, Bob Pancakes, you did nothing. So I don't know that I want you here again. Right, let's finally... See, as you can see, the demon child is still there. Let's finally wash Zach. I need to wash the clothes at some point as well. Right, I've, I've just come to put Layla to sleep while everybody's kind of chilled. And the demon child is in her bed. So we've kicked her out. And we'll get her to sleep now. Why won't you leave? Okay, she's absolutely exhausted. But Eve, Eve has aged up. She's a cute little toddler. Look at that. And you can tell she's definitely Bjorn's um, baby because she's very, very blonde. So we need an extra bed for her, which nicely fits in that room, actually. So we need to basically put all the babies to bed so that hopefully they will sleep at the same time and then Layla can get some sleep as well and we can hopefully, hopefully be on an even keel. But I've said this before and it really didn't happen and all she did was pass out. Okay, so the other two are in bed, so now it's just to put Eve into bed. Little cutie, look at her. Oh, off you go to sleep. So, yep, yeah, she's got no money to pay her bills with because she can't get any work done. Oh, uh, right. Let's tell you what. Let's try. Now that all of the children are grown up into toddlers, let's take them to the park. Um, we'll invite the demon child as well. No, we'll just ditch her there. Um, right. We'll have the two dads, and we'll try again with Bob Pancakes. Oh no, we've got too many. She can't come either. So okay. So they're all there. Quite a nice little park with some monkey bars. Oh, sentiment gained with uh, Zach and his dad. So he must be doing something. And all the kids are farting. That's lovely. Right, let's try and get her to play with the children. And just have a bit of fun. Because she's got absolutely no fun whatsoever. <laughs> So we need to try and sort that out. <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's try and let's try and play with Sophie first. Yay, there we go. So we'll try and do that with uh, Zach and with Eve as well. Oh, and Q's full. Being a little bit um a little bit uh, overzealous with the with the cues there. Okay. So that's good. That's having the desired effect. The fun bar is actually going up, which is really cool. So she can play with the kids, which is wonderful. Okay, she's now playing with Zach. So then the next one is just to play with Eve. But Eve's that little bit younger, so she might have to um, work a bit harder for her. Oh, She's very sad as well. She's not happy. We'll try and fix that as well. You'll be okay. And... Um, uh, let's then try and play. So let's try and try and cheer her up first. No, nope. oh, that went down like a lead balloon. Oh, all right, calm down. Okay, um, grungy. Okay, I tell you what. Why don't we? She won't let me clean you. Why won't you? 
Um, ah, don't know what to do now. Okay. Oh, she's doing the she's doing the Zack's diaper. She's just throwing it over her shoulder. That's that's charming. Here comes Sophie. She's gonna do Sophie's as well. Yeah, and fling it over her shoulder, which very nearly landed on Sophie's head. Okay, let's let's try again with Eve. Let's see what we can do. Oh, she let me do the. Oh, she let me play now. No, she's gonna hug. Let's have a nice cuddle. Um, let's check you over. And then um, we'll soothe you. And oh, 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 she doesn't want cuddles. That's really, really depressing, that is. A little toddler doesn't want cuddles. But that's okay. Oh, oh there you go, she's filled a nappy. Right, are you going to play now? Are you let her play? Yay! Okay, we got there in the end. Okay, so I think they're going to have to go home in a minute because they're all, like, really knackered. Yee. Considering they wouldn't have a hug earlier, that's just really sweet to see. Okay, so she's putting them to bed, and I thought, well... Or bathing one of them. We need to, we need to actually turn turn the lights and everything back on. So we've sold a load of bits uh, so that she can actually work. She needs the electricity to work, and we'll see what we can do with this. Um, we need to try and try and pick stuff. I think you can do all of these from home. Um, it's just trying to pick the right one, really. Um, and what should we do? That's that's one of the highest paid ones. So we'll do that one. Um, whether we get round to it. So, it is Harvest Fest, so we're going to put up some decorations, make it all look nice for the kids. Pretty, pretty. Yay. Okay. So, oh! Oh, the two sisters having a lovely cuddle. That's so sweet. Okay. So, she needs to cook a fantabulous Harvest Fest meal. So get cracking, Mum. Oh, she's levelled up to, to level six cooking. That's brilliant. She gets very excited when she's cooking. She's very flamboyant. If I tried all of that, I'd drop it all over the floor. Get in there. <laughs> okay, I think we're nearly there now. Oh, that looks like one of the toddlers is. Gone in for a nap. Right. Yay, cool. So she's done this lovely flamboyant meal. And um, Sophie and Eve have gone to sleep. But Zach's, Zach's up, I think. So you can um, call everybody to meal. I think you're going to put some napkins out as well. Make it all nice and pretty. There we go. Shupaza, boys. No, she's actually ringing, ringing a dinner bell. That's brilliant. Where's Zach to? Where's he gone? Oh, he's coming to get his food. Where is he? He's not very happy. Bless him. But then, although she is trying her best, she's really struggling having so many babies at once. Oh dear, I'm so sorry, Layla. That is my fault for making you pop out three babies pretty much all at the same time. <laughs> so, the girls are asleep, uh, but Zach's eating. And then, um, oh, they're going to have a little 
Nice little chat. Oh, there we go. So I think. I think she's going to take him up for a bath, which would be nice. You're allowed to automatically level up the children when they hit level three and everything, but I'm, I think we'll be lucky if we get to level one in anything for the twins, to be honest, just purely because she just did not get the hang of being a first-time mum. Uh, yeah. She needs to sleep in a minute before she passes out, I think. Okay, so she's had a nap. She hasn't done too much. Oh, the creepy gnomes are back. They keep moving around. So she's going to put the washing on. And then we need to do some of these gnome interactions, don't we? At least these ones have got clothes on. The last challenge that I did, um, there were three gnomes popped up and two of them just were just nudie. They had no clothes on whatsoever and they just had like pixelated boxes around their areas. So um, that's interesting. Okay, cool. So she's done. she's done most of them, which is wonderful. She's appeased the gnome. Which is always good. So I think we need to get her to get some sleep now. While the kids are sleeping. Oh, Zach aged up! Yay! Okay, so we need to we need to randomise what we can randomise. Got two, one, two, one. Oh dear. So what's it going to be? Erratic. Okay, that shouldn't make things any more difficult than they already are. But I think I get to pick my own aspiration because I can't um I can't randomize those but he's quite he seems he seems like a creative young man so um let's let's go for that shall we okay Sophie's gonna level up or age up rather but she's decided to do it around the back of the house apparently here she is uh two two one one oh dear um what should we she's quite Rambunctious scamp. I think that's very much her, and she's going to be self assured. <laughs> okay. Okay, we could have trouble. Oh, look, she still looks seething. Look at her. She's a very angry young lady. So, we need to um, put some beds in now. So, we need the bunk beds, really, because we haven't got room. So, we need to sell some more bits. Uh, um, we need to put the bunk beds in because we don't have enough room to put two singles in there uh, not unless I move Eve's upstairs so while mum is cooking the dinner the kids are making a mess <laughs> oh at least the demon child is gone she had she had completely gone by the time we got back and Eve is ransacking the kitchen. Fair enough. Um, okay, I think she's... Okay, she's going to get some pancakes. So we need to move uh, that one. And we need to move that around. Because there's no room for her to go into bed. I kind of thought that that might happen, to be honest. But I thought I'd take a chance. So um, let's, let's put Eve to bed. Eve's got the stink lines as well, so she needs a... Oh, somebody else is asleep as well. Someone's asleep on the sofa. I do like the bunk beds, I have to admit. The bunk beds look very cool. Okay. I know you're knackered, love. Everybody's knackered. Right, you need to finish your work. I don't know that we're going to get this done, being honest. But we can give it a go. So she's chatted with the client. She needs to write a non-fiction book. And she needs to get the book approved. So you need to crack on with that, love. I've made her have a nap. But her fun's way... Oh, she's up hoovering again. Her fun's way down. So I don't really know whether she's going to do it, to be honest. I might have to give up and send her back to bed. That is the only trouble with working from home, is that she has to be in the right mood to do it. So, crack on with that one. Go, no, you're getting up again. Okay, go to bed. And we'll try again. I don't think she's going to get that done in time. Okay, so she's... she's Oh, she's giving Sophie a really nice hug. 
which is nice. She needs to improve her. She's got a reasonable... Um, she needs her fun to go up. She's got a reasonable... Um, oh, dear, look at Eve. Oh, no. Um, no, she's got she's got good um, good relationships with all her kids, which is really nice, despite the fact that she was awful at getting anything done uh, previously for the twins. But hopefully she can make that up now. Oh, lots of cuddles. And the washing's done as well, which is helpful. We got rid... The dryer was one of the things we got rid of because... Um, she can peg it outside and it's cheaper and she doesn't have to pay for it. <laughs> okay, so she's kicked Sophie out of the bath to be able to give Eve a bath. Sink's broken, and if it wasn't that, it'd be something else. So we need to repair that. At least Sophie's reasonably happy at the moment, which makes a change. Okay, so she's fixing that. Oh! Under what conditions? Yay! Inheritance! Ooh! Festival. Let's go to the snow festival. Let's take the kids as well. So, she can go out now that they're kind of like toddlers and upwards. So, let's let's build a snow pal with Eve. Let's do that for a minute. Because the older guys can go in and I believe they can actually go in the uh, hot tub or in the hot springs, whatever it is. Um... But Eve can't. So let's let's try and build. Do you want to build a snowman? Let's put some proper um, clothes on her as well. She's not going to do very well in the snow in a t-shirt, is she? So let's try and sort that out. And we'll see if there's anybody else here that she can now possibly find baby daddy number three. Because remember, although there are three kids, there are only two dads because uh, Sophie and Zach are twins. So, for her first pregnancy, that was a bit of a flipping shock. So, let's, um, we'll finish this up with Eve and then I'll send her in the hot springs and see if anybody else turns up. to be able to do that. I wonder if baby, I wonder if the toddlers can actually do the snowboarding as well. I'll have to, I'll have to try that next time, I think. <laughs> okay, that's quite cool. <laughs> the lovely decorations on that one. He's brilliant. I like him. He's very cool. Okay, so she's, she's just changed Eve into some winter stuff, which is good. All right, pick her up and bring her inside, I think. And we'll, um... We'll go in the... Relax in the hot springs together. Let's... Oh! Oh, there's somebody in there already. Oh! Next victim! Takashi. Okay. Cool. Let's... Let's... Let's slow play it. We'll do it with friendly introductions first because she's done flirty with everything before and it's just put us in minus figures. Uh, and we've had to just try and... Whoa, hey, where's my camera going? Uh, we've had to just uh, catch up them. Which is what's happened with Bob Pancakes, to be honest. He, she was flirty at first, and then he came over and tried flirting again, and he really wasn't up for it. So um, let's see. No, we don't want the Romance Festival for the minute because we're here at the Snow Festival. So we might be doing well just here. Right, so you're going to introduce yourself, love. Oh, he's quite flirty already. Well, that's a bonus. That's quite good. So, we need to try and get a bit of a friendship bar going first. Where's, where's Eve? Oh, Eve's just playful. She's happy. So, that's all right. She's out in the snow. Okay. So, let's try and let's try and improve things here. Oh. What happened there? Okay, let's try a little bit of romance now. Let's try a bit of flirting. Oh, right in front of your daughter. She does not like that. Look at the stare. <laughs> She's just staring. You're so embarrassing. Right, okay. Let's try a pickup line. It's going down quite well, though. He's, he's quite flirty. He must be naturally quite flirty, I would imagine. Because it's, it's being well-received. So compliment his appearance. 
And, oh, Eve's, Eve's not happy. Okay, Eve's tired. They're all quite tired, to be honest. I think she might have to um, go home in a minute. She could ask him to come with her, though. Let's see if that works. Let's get him to come home. Yay! So he came home. Let's let's try a bit more flirting. Let's try and kiss his hands. And then you need to put Eve to bed. Get a bit of peace and quiet. Yeah, she's tired as well. Patience, Layla. So hopefully Eve will go to sleep reasonably well and then we can try and get our flirt on with Takashi. Oh yeah, first kiss, right, okay. So we need to um no don't nap. No, we don't want we don't want the twins dad coming over, not when we're trying to uh make baby number four. Oh, okay. Will this happen? Oh! Yay! Okay, cool. So, first kiss has happened. We've got quite a good flirt on. They can't... Okay, they can't woohoo yet. So, let's... Um, we'll get them to sit and chat. Hang on a minute. Why is... Eve's woken up again, which is a bit annoying. Um, let's get a few more interactions going. We need to put Eve back to bed. Uh, invite to stay the night. Will you stay the night so you don't say that you have to go home? Are you going to stay? Yay! Okay, cool. Sleepover sounds great. Right, let's... Um, you can at least then have a nap and get your strength back in a minute. We need to... We need to put Eve to bed. First, though... Oh, she's falling asleep on the floor. Why did you get out of bed, you silly girl? Oh. Right. Wake her up. And put her back to bed again. Let's try again. She even got out of bed and put, like, her normal clothes on as well. That's... That's really annoying. Okay, right. Put her to bed. Right, I wonder... Okay, so we can woohoo. No, I didn't want to do that. Um, let's see, where is it, where is it, where is it? I can't find it. Okay, all right, we'll go, go to the toilet first, and I can see if I can do it that way. So where's the bed? Okay, so is it on there? Is it on there? Yes! Okay, try for a baby. Hey, cool. Okay, so they're both quite happy to try for a baby. Despite the fact that they only met each other about two hours ago, but there you go. It's one hell of a commitment. Okay, let's um oh, uh, always really trippy when they're like in between each other. Right. Okie dokie. So we'll um do a bit of uh, speed woohooing again because it's always incredibly awkward. Okay, time for a pregnancy test. Time for a pregnancy test. Go, Layla, go. Go, Layla, go. And then go to sleep. And instant baby bump. Okay, cool. So she is eating for two. She's got the next baby on the way. With baby daddy number three, Takashi. And that's where we'll leave it there. So, um, thank you for watching. If you're new, please like and subscribe. Chuck down in the comments anything that you uh, think would uh, add to this challenge. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!